Hey Closeteers, it's Zach, and if you're watching me, it must be Wednesday. It's LGBT Movie Week, and this is my favorite topic so far. I am a movie freak, and I love movies, and especially LGBT movies. And it's been so hard for me to pick which one is my favorite, because I really don't know. Um, I love so many of them, um, but I've narrowed it down for you today. To one. 20 centimetros, or 20 centimeters in the US. It's a Spanish film directed by um, Ramon Salazar, who also wrote the film. And it stars Monica Serrera, who also, I mean, she's done a little bit of stuff, but mostly stuff in the 2000s. The plot of the movie is that Marietta, is, uh, who's played by Monica Severa, is saving up for her last operation to go from male to female. She's got one operation to go. And um, she makes her money as a prostitute because like, um, well, there's a couple reasons. But basically, um, anyway, that's like the best way she can like make quick money is by becoming a prostitute. And, but her flatmate, Tomas, who is a little person who I love, he's so cute. Um, Miguel Odority is his name in real life. He is always um, like spending or stealing or like talking her out of her money, or, like losing her money for her. He's like, says he's gonna invest it and he, he loses it. So she like gets so close to like getting the surgery and then she doesn't. But also she starts to meet this guy, Raul. And he's like so fine. The one thing he really loves about her is the one thing that she wants to uh, remove. So that's a little bit of a problem. Um, and to top it all off, so this whole thing, Marietta has narcolepsy, which means she can fall asleep at any time. And um, when she falls asleep, she has these really elaborate like dance and song scenes uh, in which she's the star and um, they're so wonderful. Um, but it's a real problem in her life, obviously, in the movie. And her biggest dream, it's so sweet, is just to become like a normal woman and like have like a desk job or like, you know, be a receptionist or something like super normal. And, um, you know, having this surgery, you know, to become like fully, like on the outside who she feels like she is on the inside just is like the biggest part of the story. Warning, it does have like some graphic stuff in it. This is not like PG-13. This is uh, R with some like, some graphic stuff. So kids, you, you know, you should talk to your parents about renting it, but they may not like it. It's funny, it's heartwarming, it's got big musical numbers, it's a LGBT movie without being like, hey, here is a gay person, or having like a token gay person, or having stereotypes of any kind, really. It just is a movie about this woman, you know, who just wants to live her life, and these are the things that happen in her life. Anyone has seen um, El Moldovar movies? Uh, I get a flavor of this, of, of his movies in this movie, um, and maybe only because they're both Spanish. Um, but I, I, the colors there, the dramas there of an Almodovar movie, but you know, there's definitely some differences. So I think if you like Almodovar, you'll like this movie and like won't really care that, that it's about um, a transsexual. Um, but I highly recommend you check it out. As a side note, I love movies so much and have been like having such a hard time going through my list of uh, gay movies to talk about that um, I've decided I'm just going to start doing this on my own channel, on uh, Ferdy Bowl. I'll link it. Um, be, and so just come over and like every week I'll just put something up about um, an LGBT movie that I think you should check out and why and what it's about a little bit. And yeah, so I hope you like this. I hope you get to check out this movie if you are old enough and mature enough to handle the um, content because it's, you know, TVMA. Uh, but yeah, I'm looking forward to see what other um, collab members um, think about this movie or, th or what other movies that they have, su have to suggest. And if you have a suggestion uh, or any thoughts about this movie or any movies that you want me to check out, 
comment, uh, make a video response below, and uh, we will totally check it out. All right, guys. See you next week. Bye.